In this video, I'm going to show you how to turn on an ATX computer power supply, a really common source of 12 volt or 5 volts power supplies. Um, mine's a smaller one, but yours might look like a square with a fan in the back, but they're all essentially the same. And the way we do this, um, it's really easy. So you're going to look for this connector here, and you're going to count three wires over from the top, looking at this little clip on the top here and then the fourth wire, so the third and the fourth wire and what you're going to do is you're going to jump them, you're going to short the two of them together um, and it will cause the power supply to turn on. What I've done is I've hooked a switch up to it and cut into the two wires, spliced into it here. I put some uh, electrical uh, tape on it, some liquid electrical tape and all that does is it just makes it easier so when I flick this on it turns on, turns off. Um, so off of these plugs, if you use a multimeter, you can get power off them depending on what you want, if it's 5 volts or 12 volts. Um, so I have a light bulb hooked up here, connected to one of these plugs. This is only 5 volts, so this bulb is a 12 volt. It won't be that bright, but it'll just show you that it does work. So I'll flick it on. See? It comes on. Flick it off. It turns off. Simple as that. And that is how you turn on and off an ATX computer power supply. Now off of this plug here you're going to get 12 volts I believe. Um, I wasn't able to to put my alligator clips on it or else that bulb would be brighter but um, it's just drawing 5 volts right now but for the purposes of this video it works. Um, I'll post a picture at the end of the video of this clip here too so you can get a better sense of which two wires it is. Thanks for watching.